I loved the idea of bringing so many languages together in one piece because that doesn't happen very often. I was trying to think, what do we have that we all share? And of course, we share the planet and we share the sun. Languages are an enormously important part of human life, the way we tick, the way we communicate. What's perhaps not so well understood is how they connect with our creativity. One school in Oxford has over a hundred languages represented amongst the pupils. And we thought that to create a musical piece that would provide an opportunity for schools to come together and share those languages would be a really interesting thing to do and would also tell us something about how languages work now in our local community. Normally when you do a concert, you rehearse everybody individually and then bring it all together. But of course here we're working with so many different schools, so many different pupils. We went round in small groups to uh, different primary schools and we all taught sections of the songs. Singing is much easier than speaking. There's a meter and a measure to it. You've got time. And I used repetition and I only used fragments of, of each language so they weren't overloaded. They amazed me at how well they picked up those languages. Some of them would say, no, actually, I think it's pronounced more like this. So I said, brilliant, we'll go with that, because if you've got an authentic speaker there, that makes all the difference. Often when I've been singing with, with primary school kids, you have the keen musicians at the front and you have perhaps the people at the back who are, are less keen. And here, everyone has a little moment to shine and, and some of the quieter ones have really come forward and that's been a really lovely thing to see. Languages bring communities together, music brings people together.